We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. A park? Anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and we were buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants at Yamantau, I want it more. Hey everyone, welcome. Back to some more Cold War. Uh, I said that completely wrong. Uh, hey everyone, it's the Wolf. Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we are playing some more uh, Cold War. Cold War. Edit a lot of the boring parts. So I'm gonna start doing that now because uh, I don't want to make so many like almost one-hour videos uh, of just gameplay. I actually want to cut out a bit of the videos. So uh, just make it. You know, you know what shorter. Does to agents. Yep. So you're not gonna be sitting here for like an hour, <laughs> just watching. Duh. If they win this season, it's almost worth facing the fighting squad. Because I know hey. that there's gonna be a lot I of boring parts. So you find yourself a new ride. Come on, let's All get right. moving, Mason. Let's go. Oh, I have a sniper. Nice. And uh, secondary weapon is uh, just That's a pistol. Inside, yeah. Man. Alright, nice. This does not remind me of any Black Ops games. It reminds me so much of Modern Warfare games. Especially, uh, Modern Warfare 2 in the snow. In the snow, uh, mission in, uh, I think it, I can't remember where it was. I think it was in somewhere, like, in Russia or something. I think I can't really remember. That's what this place reminds me of more. You know, I, 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 if the game just tells me where to go, I can just get to the quicker. Yeah, you're the expert in quiet. I'm a goddamn onion, Mason. You should know that. Yes. Okay, and. Good kill. Hopefully nobody heard. Woods, why didn't you shoot straight away? Enough threats. Got him. Let's go. No one to worry about over there. Uh, let's zip line now. There we go. Yep, there was no one to uh, worry about over there, so everything's all good. Let me just get my pistol out just in case someone is over here. Piece of wait. Wait, was he like exactly behind me when I was on the zip line? Now I actually recognize this mission from uh if I remember correctly I think this is where uh you go in uh in Black Ops 1 in that one place where you're supposed to like find that guy I've not played Black Ops 1 in a very long time so I can't really remember exactly but you go into that area and find a guy and uh I think torture him or something I can't remember what you do oh wait there's a lot of people that can see me okay I remember something to do with, like, the windows. You smash the windows or something. There we go. Sm they, like, uh, it was Hudson, and he smashed the windows. <sighs> see nothing. Maybe they saw it? Yeah, they did. They saw it. They, they definitely saw that. That was a very bad idea to shoot that guy. I like it that when I shoot, when I uh, go into a... Uh, this mode, it actually goes into slow motion. It's amazing. Makes sniping much easier in this game. Alright, screw this. Where's, uh... There we go. Yo. Uh, Woods, Woods like that. Woods likes it when, uh, I get really loud weapons, apparently. Going loud, huh? Nice. Alright, where you at? There we go, let's go this way. Jesus. I would not like to be in this area right here. Ooh. 
I don't remember this exact mission, like everything in the mission, like in the original, but all I know is it was a pretty uh, kind of iconic uh, mission, kind of. I can't remember, I think it was like close to the middle part, damn it. I was talking way too much that I just wasn't concentrating on the game for some reason. Uh, all I know is it was in like the middle of Black Ops 1 or something around about that area. This gun seems like an SMG just because of the way I'm holding it. get this since we're going loud so I might as well uh, get a loud weapon really matter, as long as I can get a fast really fast fast weapon that will be amazing there we go all right anyone else in that place I don't think so let's get up here I love these missions because you get to play as the old cat oh <laughs> well I didn't really need that AK, I just picked up that AK so I didn't really need it, so uh, it's like I just pick up another one. It's not like it was like the sniper that I had before on anything. So it's all good. Wait, did I lose the pistol as well? No! Um, I mean, it doesn't really matter because I would have lost the sniper anyway because I don't think I can get back to where I was, where I dropped it. Alright, um, there we go. Even though I don't like editing these kinds of videos, I'm still gonna make this way shorter than a normal video. Normally my videos on these games are around about like 50 to 40 minutes, normally. You don't see nothing. Did he even shoot me once? If he didn't, then that's amazing because I can stay stealthy. Alright, give me the shotgun just in case. No, they definitely heard. Yep, they definitely heard those. Uh, don't, that, that gunshot. That must have been a gunshot. So I don't think I heard a gunshot because I was in the animation of a uh, hidden gun. There we go. Also, uh, once I finish this game. Uh, I want you guys to write in the comments of this video and all my other videos on this game uh, what you guys want me to make videos on next. Uh, I'll uh, put a, um, I'll put like in the comments, I'll put a, um, I'll put like a uh, list of um, videos to make. Hey, I got a trophy. Um, a list of videos to make uh, and which game you guys want me to make a video on. But there's a high chance that most of them will be um, possibly uh, not like these types of games. Like more like funny moment videos on like GTA or something. Like that. But I don't know what games I'm gonna put onto the list because I've not I'm, like I'm not editing the video yet. Because I'm just recording it. Okay, here we go. And I like it that this game is uh, throwing back to the uh, first game. I'm actually surprised I've not seen any references to World at War. So I'm actually surprised about it. But yeah, again, it's not really around like the same thing that there's no uh, resin or anything like in this. I mean, there is in Black Ops 2, but a little bit. But it just like the storyline just makes sense not having a. That Nova 6 business was just the tip of the iceberg. Oh, uh, so what am I supposed to be looking Looks for? Like up and ready to move out. Oh, wait, oh. So this truck, okay. This is what I'm looking at. Alright. Oh, right <laughs> I, I just, I just, uh, went off the, uh, camera thing, uh, at the right time. Because we're going now. Uh... Alright, here we go. Let's go. Well, even if we were stealthy the entire time, we would have got caught anyway. So it doesn't really matter. Time to go loud. Oh, I thought there was some there. No, that's just a box or something. Right. There we go. 
come out of that woods. Cover. That was a bad way like time to shoot. How you doing? Get out of here. Uh okay. Down here. I think if I remember correctly, I think this is the first Call of Duty. I I can't remember if uh World World War Two had it because uh I played that on the channel like at the start of 2020, so uh or something like that. So I can't remember, but I I think this is the first, uh, like, Call of Duty that's based in the past that had the, uh, sliding ability, that like, has the sliding abilities. And I'm not talking about Black Ops 4 when it had the, like, the, like, the zombies maps, because those are, like, way back in the past. I base. Yeah. Like, but I can't remember, uh, I think, I think, uh, Oh wait, hello. I think World War II did have sliding abilities, I'm not sure. What are you doing up there? Oh, hello. I and I also forgot that I've not been doing a question of the day, so uh, if you guys want to like, do a question of the day thing, uh, the question of the day will be uh, what's your favorite Call of Duty game there? I think I might have already said that in uh, a uh, past video, but. Whatever. That's good. Just run. Just run through. Okay. Alright. Boom. Boom. Oh, hello there. You didn't hit me. Yeah. Nice Alright. Done. There we go. Oh, hello there. Alright. I like it that try well, I'll give it Black Ops games. Uh, so why I like it that they actually, instead of doing what they did to Modern Warfare, uh, I'm going to be actually kept with, like, the main storyline. That's why I like it. All, that means all the Black Ops games are like connected into one storyline, which makes it a lot easier to understand the storyline. Instead of having two different storylines. Okay, so. Oh, wait, we gotta go down there, okay. How about I jump down? Wait, do I have to actually jump down? No. <laughs> Just wanted to test it out. He, he said, "Maybe we need to get down there." So uh, I just jumped down there because uh, he told us to be that we had to get down. Um, okay, that's good. I'm guessing it means in somewhere around here. No. Um, any stairs that we can go down? Yes, there is. Well, when I say stairs, I mean like a slide of uh, this building. This building. Wait, how did Woods get down there? Woods didn't even go over here. How did Woods get all the way down there? He didn't just jump all the way down. Lucky. I died last time I tried to do that. I had to get behind someone so I can use him as a body shield just so I can kill a bunch of them. Get back up. You ain't hear me. Yeah, there's definitely not one over there. Here we go, okay, let's get it. Now also, uh, you guys can write in the comments if you like the normal like style that I do, which is like, make the videos really long, like for the full, like, ex for my full ex like, experience of the game. Oh, oh wait, there we go. Uh, or if you don't like it, if I made just like shorter videos, so you, like, there's less time watching the videos. But like, all like the best parts of the episode, basically. Lock, Take us up. You know, just tell me that if you guys want to have some stuff. Can I pick this up? Just give me this. Oh, jeez. 
I can't, I can't hit these guys because of this thing that I'm sitting on, which is uh, moving all over the place. But that, that's because of physics. Physics are amazing this game. That's what I like about these games. I can't hit as many people as I can, but I can't really see them. Get him, get him. There we go. I'm gonna die because there's. I can't even. Where are the enemies? There they are. Because of this thing that I'm sitting on, it's just moving so much I can't see anyone. There we go, perfect. Nice. Can I. Oh, I can't shoot that, damn it. Alright, well, that's the end of that mission. And four days later. Okay, here we go. Hudson. We finished analyzing that mainframe that Mason Woods brought from Yamato. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleeper agents Dragovich used in 68. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus erased them. Fuck me. There's only one place you're gonna find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know. But we're gonna do this the right way. We're not gonna do it at all. Alright, so... Um... So we, uh... Got an idea... I'm guessing... I got a bit of an idea of where we're going next, I'm guessing. No, I mean, that's what I'm thinking anyway. Uh, so, um... This is fun. <laughs> now, uh, on the, uh, like, like, me making the video shorter, I'm obviously gonna keep all the cutscenes, like, the full cutscenes in the, uh, videos, but I'm gonna cut a bunch of, like, the boring parts, like, this loading time. Um, because these, these loading times are just so long. That it's just gonna be so boring, so uh, I'll cut these out. So if you see cuts in the video, that's because it's like a really boring part and there's nothing really fun happening. Uh, it's just like just to make the video more fun, you know. And if you guys want to, next video I can try and finish the entire game uh, and just only show like the entire uh, Are you taking him into the, KGB of the best with you? stuff. Are you crazy? Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Ooh. Bell. He's got the skill we need. Okay. Hmm. Join me this. You're risking the entire operation unnecessarily. It's not unnecessary. It's calculated. Just understand that if you botch this, we can't get those names. It's over. I know you can do this. Hudson doesn't trust anyone he can't control. Alright. Well then. I have to say that Hudson... From looking at what he looks like in, um... Mod uh, Black Ops 1 to Black Ops 2... He... Doesn't really, like, eh. I can s I can see how he looks the same, definitely. But, um... He looks more like Black Ops... One, Black Ops One Hudson. That's what he looks like more. Before Black Ops Two, so that's interesting. Uh, okay, so next mission. Uh, so, um, okay, so we're going to uh, do a risky plan. So let's do this. Uh, so we've got all this stuff done. Yeah. These are all the missions here that we've done. Let's uh, go to the next mission. Uh, launch mission. Boom. Let's do this. Here we go. This is going to be fun. Here we go. The Lubyanka building. KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. 
This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Alright, so... Um... So far this sounds pretty... Pretty cool. Um... Reminds me a lot of, uh, like it's, it's def the game is definitely reminding me a lot of the first Black Ops game. Not, it's not, it's not even reminding me barely of the second game, it's mostly just the first game that it's reminding me of a lot. The second game, you didn't really have that much, uh, 1980, like, actually, it was more of a future. Uh, but it was, like, half of the game was, like, um, in the past, so, uh... It kind of reminds me a little bit of that, but mostly just Black Ops 1, this reminds me of. And that came out around about 11 year, 10, 11 years ago. Can't really remember. Um, here we go. Hello. Let's do this. Alright. friends yet, Belikov. Did you get access to the bunker? There's always a problem. Solve it. We're getting the files in that bunker. Do whatever it takes. And one more thing. One of our East Berlin informants recently switched sides and fled for Moscow. We have reason to believe he's in the Lubyanka building today. He knows too much about our Berlin network. I'm thinking an early retirement. Good man. Now I know why Hudson thinks so highly of you. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Anna Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. Alright, so, we are undercover, I think, well, uh, I'm playing as the uh, guy, so we're not really, uh, being undercover, I guess. I guess that's the best way. If we're playing as our normal character, yes, we would be undercover, but, I wouldn't really count this as undercover, I don't think. Alright, here we go, let's go into this room. Oh, nice, he's just opened the door for me. Thank you. Alright, let's uh, sit down. Alright. There's a mole within the KGB. The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. <clears throat> I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov. As head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this mole. How is that gone? I understand. Perhaps the love you hold for your comrades is so strong that you can't possibly imagine such betrayal. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, Belikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation?
Comrade Belikov, my apologies. Even your bunker access has been revoked. We can't be too cautious, can we? Secretary Gorbachev, I believe it would be best if only General Charkov retains his bunker key for now. Very well. See to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. The traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Belikov, you are dismissed. Okay, so uh, I noticed a bunch of stuff there. That might have been, if you guys saw me like moving the camera, like strangely, because I noticed a few things. First thing, oh, uh, the map. Oh, I can see. I need a bunker key. Now first, I'll have to kill the cameras. Okay. So where am I? I'm right here, so let's get to the cameras. Can I uh, like hover over the camera room? Oh, hello there. Ah, okay. So, uh, that was a uh, Sakai of uh, Anna uh, Kravchenko, so that's uh, interesting. Uh, because uh, he, well, uh, Sakai of is from uh, Modern Warfare, which makes no sense. Because normally the Black Ops and Modern Warfare games aren't supposed to be in the same storyline. Can I attack you? Non lethal takedown, yes. Take him down, and is that a locker that I can put him in? Go, go, uh, Agent Forty Seven style. Carry a body. Yes, there is as well. There is a, there is a uh, place I can hide the body. That's amazing. You know, eight Agent Forty Seven. Let's go. Thing is, I I am the Russian Agent Forty Seven. That's the thing. Actually, I don't know. I don't know what this character this uh, character looks like. I can't remember. The c person I'm playing as. To get the bunker key for okay. Needed to access the vault. So. Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. I'm gonna go to this place first. I'm gonna make sure that I uh, take out all of these objectives. That 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 sounded completely wrong. I'm saying completely wrong, as in like just I I, I said that completely wrong. I should have said it a bit more. Basically making it so it makes sense. Uh, lock pick lock. Uh, okay, so if I get caught, nope, uh, nothing's going on over here. Just um, uh, nothing's going on over here. Just keep on going that way. Uh, what does this sign say? Hey, there we go. Oh, wait. I need to make sure he's gonna look back here in a second. Yep, there we go. Okay. If I tried to pick the lock, he would have saw me. Oh, he started to see me. Is he gonna go backwards? He's coming this way, damn it. Oh, what's in this room? Let's go in this room. I shall go in this room, shouldn't we? What's up? Um. Oh, there's a broom here. Oh, he didn't suspect a thing. Now pick the lock quickly. If I'm seeing this, would be treason. Okay. <laughs> me just looking at the guy, and he's just looking at me like this guy definitely suspects something. I almost had that done as well, and he had to just come and look. Nice. Okay, close the door. Non-lethal takedown. Oh, oh ju just a le just a takedown, not a non-lethal. Okay. Just take the guy down. Okay. Um, where's the keys? Wait, is it keys I'm trying to get here? There's a file here. Okay. Is that a place I can put the body? Yes. Carry a body. And put the body in here. <laughs> this reminds me so much of Hitman just because uh, I'm going into restricted areas. 
and uh, if I get caught here, it's not easy being a devil then uh, they're probably gonna t tell me to go, go out, probably. Okay, Alright, let's go back to the map. What should I do next? I'm gonna go to here since it's really close to me. Let's go do that. Yep, you saw nothing. I didn't go out that door. This guy apparently didn't see me just go out that door. Okay. What can I do for you, Comrade Belikov? Um. The general will be questioning a yes. prisoner today, but should be available most of the time. Okay. Um, poison. Yes. Wait, what? I can't poison him. Just let me know when you're ready to meet with him. <laughs> okay, so do I'm guessing I need a. Uh, I need to, if I can go a bit faster, that would be amazing. Don't worry, just crouching over here. Just don't look. Uh, nothing's going on over here. I could turn one of these people into a like a, a, a body shield, but there's no point in doing that. Oh yeah, and this guy is alive because of. Uh, he's in Black Ops 2 as well. Okay. Um. Okay. There we go. Comrade. Map updated. Uh, hey everyone. I was just about to say my intro for a second, but no. Uh, this is the next part of the video. Um. So basically, it's been a week. Uh, since the last clip that you guys saw. Uh, it's because I was struggling on this part of the mission, and it, I just kept on doing so many attempts. I then gave up and just didn't play it for like five days, and now I'm back. So, uh, basically, basically, I have finished all the things now. I actually did it in one attempt, which I'm really happy about, because it took me forever to do it in one attempt. So, uh, let me take this. I finally did all of this that I was meant to do, and it took forever, but I finally did it. Uh, there's all these things that I could have done right here, but um, I don't really care, because I want to just finish this mission. So, uh, yes, yeah, so let's get into this place. How can I help you, sir? That bunker key, there we go. I have the bunker key, let me in. Thank you. Let me in these doors. <coughs> Alright. There's some people down here, okay. Let me turn my volume down as well, there we go. Um. <coughs> uh, radio. Press L1 to radio guards. Oh, okay, yeah. Mm. Okay. In the furnace room, okay. Let's open the door. Ah, Morse code, I think. I think, yeah, I, think I was using Morse code with um, a flashlight. That's pretty cool. Alright. Welcome in. Is that, what, is that what I was meant to say? Welcome in. Yes. Welcome this to this place. Gives you to the Thank you. What about uniforms? <laughs> I shall choke you. Damn it. I can't. I was going to try and knock him out. <laughs> no. Take cover. Keep it clean. You, you were detected. He literally just said go to cover and then I instantly got caught gives you okay then okay I'm gonna instantly go to this side actually no I need to go to this side I think like here we go let's go to here then okay, I will lead them to the <coughs> okay I'll just, I'll just chill here then keep it clean uniforms are no good to us bloody all right <coughs> Okay, yeah. You don't, you don't see nothing. Die! Yeah, that's what you call an awesome takedown. Oh, we actually killed them, I think. Okay. Damn! 
Wait, they, I'm, I'm guessing they're dead. Well, I don't even need to guess because I know that they're dead. All right, so now we're undercover, I guess. So that's pretty cool. Hmm. Um, all right. Uh, what gun did you give me? I don't see a gun. This way. Okay, uh, let's go then. <laughs> Wait, where, where did you go? There you are. <laughs> Alright, so we're going undercover in this place now, which is awesome. I thought this was a prison for a second, it's not, it's uh, like a, I don't even know what that, what that room is. Uh, don't worry, I'm just trying to get past. Oh. They think, uh, they think that, um, the, the guy that I was playing as a second ago, they, they think that he's the, like, because he keeps, he keeps saying that, uh, he's the, uh, traitor, but because I gave them the, uh, evidence, they don't think it is him, so that's perfect. I, had, I think I probably had the choice, there was a poison option, so I think I had the choice to either kill him, uh, or, um, like frame him. I don't know if there's any other options, but those <coughs> were the other ones I know of at the moment. <coughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> um, <coughs> there we go. Oh, okay. Okay, we have to go through the checkpoint. <coughs> we're, we're all we're safe. Okay, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> his, his Russian is pretty good, I like that. Good job, I, good job I have sub subtitles on, because I have no idea what they're saying. Well, I do, because obviously I've got subtitles on. <coughs> Alright, here we go. You need to go to the cave. I'll explain. Thank you, friend. Alright, so. A good job he came at the right time. Um. So, I don't know why I keep him looking up. I, that's not my controller doing that. I'm, I just keep him looking up. Like, my controller has been messing up, like, making me look upwards every time I press a certain button. But it's. I, it's not doing it. I just don't know why I'm just looking up like that. See, I did it again. Alright. Take us down. Take us down. We're going down to the basement, I think. Bunker level, yeah, so we're going to the bunker. That's pretty good. Let's go. Oh. Oh, no. Uh, oh. There's, there's my phone. Hmm. Oh. Uh, Just today, you know. We, we we just arrived today. Because uh, because obviously if I say we've been here for a long time, he's gonna know that we haven't. Um. This one. Damn it. I don't know if I would have got caught anyway. I just cracked my I just cracked my leg. If you guys heard a click, sorry about that. And that was perfect timing because as soon as I did that, a second, I soon, as soon as uh, that click happened, a second later, <laughs> the guy, like, I just punched the guy. Alright, here we go. This is America. <laughs> that, that's the first thing I've, I, 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 I wanted to do like an entrance, like, sentence thing, like, say something really cool as I come through. I know that's the first thing that came in my head. Since I mean we're basically Americans. friendly file not okay I'm guessing the grenade hit uh, Adler because I was shooting at a guy and I was like wait that's not that's not a uh, that's not a enemy this is America y'all gonna lose 
uh, give me some grenades. I already have four grenades, so there's no point in trying to get some. Uh, throw. I c wanted to throw that back. I wanted to throw that back. I don't. I don't think I was. Was I not close enough to get that? That's annoying. Oh. Yes, come here. Alright. Hello there. I'm just stab you. That messed up completely. Wait. If I have if I have my primary weapon as a like a machine gun and my secondary weapon as a shotgun, where did that pistol come from? I had a pistol when I knocked the guy out. Wait, what? So I have three weapons? Why well, can't I use the pistol whenever I want? <laughs> Because obviously, like, I have, I, obviously I have my, uh, assault rifle in my hand and then I have my shotgun on my back, probably. So where's my pistol? I mean, obviously I know where my pistol is, but if I am holding my pistol, then where's my AR? Because it's on my back, then where's my shotgun? I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just breaking, breaking a lot of people. That's the word I'm thinking of. Uh, breaking people's minds. No. Uh, like, I, I, don't, I don't know the word. Uh, I'm hurting you guys' mind. That's, that's the best. That's the best way of saying it. Um, the, the only way I could think I could have hold, held my shotgun and my uh, assault rifle uh, while holding that uh, pistol is if um, is if we had them both on our backs, I guess. Probably none, no, probably none of this is making any sense, what I'm saying right now. Good. Let's get to the vault. Alright. Here we go. I can't even shoot the guy because Alpha's right in front of me, so I can't shoot him. Can't shoot anyone in front of him. I keep on holding on to the, uh, I don't know why, but I keep on holding on to... Because I've been playing a lot of Minecraft recently, so I keep on pressing, uh, I keep on, I keep on clicking the, uh, run button and then not holding it again, because that's normally what you have to do to run, you don't have to, like, keep hold of the gun, I mean, keep, keep hold of the gun, keep hold of the, uh, button, like, keep, don't, you don't have to keep hold of the, uh, analog stick, but, um, because we're playing Cold War, you have to keep hold of the, uh, R3, left analog, to, um, Run. So I keep on going like this. Uh, use bunker key. Here we go. Because there's only one bunker key, I think. And I have that right here. There it is. And open. There we go. Also, guys, since since it's been a long time for me making this one video, uh, I'm going to also. Oh, hello. Oh god. Uh. Perfect. Um, I'll, I'm gonna make um, a video on like one of those, and I'm gonna make a return of like the tour videos on Minecraft that I used to do. Um, like me just like going to random worlds and then uh, checking them out. You know, it's been a while since the last time I did it. Uh, I'm guessing this one since this is the only name I can remember. Yeah, yeah. Died in 1960 something. Yeah, yeah, 1960. Um, copy to disc, yes. Because he was the main, well, he was, like, the main, main villain of, uh, Black Ops 1, Dragovic. Oh, God. Where'd you go? Where did you, where did you just go? Uh, any frags, I guess? Where did he go? Oh, there you are. <laughs> He's right behind me. Uh, give me mines, actually. I'm gonna get some mines and I'm gonna throw them around this area. And then, here we go. Boom. Everybody die. Wait, I'm gonna throw a smoke grenade. I think that's a smoke grenade. Throw it back. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't killing me. You ain't killing me. And what's annoying is I'm gonna have to play through this game all over again to get the uh, like the other trophies. Try and play through this entire thing on veteran mode because that's what I do on every Call of Duty. 
every Call of Duty I play, if I'm not making a video on it, if it's like an old Call of Duty that I just like got for Xbox 360 or something, which is a lot of them, I wouldn't really make a video on it, obviously. Um, so uh, normally I would just try and complete the game normally, see, like know what's happening, and then once I finished it on like recruit or regular, I would uh, go to veteran and uh, play it then, just so I can get the achievements on Xbox if I was playing on Xbox or whatever, you know. And also because I like the challenge. I, w I would have made a uh, Modern Warfare 2019 uh, gameplay. I would have I would have done that, but the thing is, by the time I got the game, I already know I already knew the entire storyline because uh, I watched a lot of videos on YouTube about like the game. So I like watching those kinds of gameplay videos. But I made sure not to watch any Cold War videos because I because I knew that I knew that I could have a high chance of getting the game, and I really wanted the game. So uh, well, I got the game. So uh. I didn't want to make, I didn't want to like look at videos to see what happens. I don't like this. We're sick of here. Keep moving. Mm. Okay. Find a way out. Yeah. We need to find a way out, but the thing is, uh, in front of me is the way out. I, I know that someone's gonna show up shooting us in a second. There we go. I as I say it. <laughs> as I say it, someone shows up. It's almost like they knew that we were here. I'm guessing they're behind these walls. Pr pretty predictable. Yeah, there we go. Pretty predictable that they go from behind the walls. From behind the walls. Hello there. You dead now? Oh, good. This video would have been uploaded a few days ago, like from when this video is uploaded. It would have been uploaded a few days ago, but I just didn't really wanna keep on playing the game because I knew I, I thought I was gonna like keep on failing over and over again but I did this just today I went on to it and finished it first try This is Nova 6, I think. I think this is Nova 6. Okay, quickly. Give him a gas mask. <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> I tried to put the mask on him and then out of nowhere. Like, I just see my hands and out of nowhere, a mask just teleports randomly in my hand and then it just is on him. Also, realistically, I don't think that would actually happen. Obviously, this is Call of Duty, so it shouldn't really be realistic, but. Like, if, if I put a gas mask on him, he wouldn't have, like, like was it, like, recovered, I guess, from, uh, all that gas. Like, him, uh, like, smelling, not, not smelling, uh, like, inhaling the gas. He w I don't think he would have, uh, it w I don't think it would have been that quick. Unless the guy's a trooper and he just takes the gas and survives. Mm. You're dead. And also, if I just start this stream, I'm gonna join that stream after this video. Uh, cause I want to edit the video and while I'm waiting for the video to render, I'll be in that stream. I don't know why I'm saying it cause I don't even think any of you guys who are watching this will even be in that stream when it's live because, uh, this video is probably gonna take, like, by the time this video is uploaded. I wasn't sure when it was gonna blow up so I, w I just wanted to stay as far back as I could just to have a chance of surviving cause I didn't know if it would explode instantly as soon as I start running that way. So, because that's normally what happens if, if it's there, I always like stand still and hope it doesn't get too close to me. Normally, that's what I do. And throw a grenade. Because I know there's some people down there. Oh, hello. Oh, yep, yeah. I throw a grenade over there and nothing happens. Nice one. Uh, can I sit here? Perfect. I also love that. Uh, the gas mask actually shows up on my face, kind of. Now you can see like the shadows of it. Not shadows, like the part of the gas mask on the face. I like that. Oh, take the gear. Wait, is this? Is this? I don't know. I don't know if this is really bad quality, or if the gear is supposed to look like that. 
Okay, yeah, the gear is definitely not supposed to look like that because I think they're wearing the same out the same health health uh, helmets. There we go. I think they're wearing the same out like helmets. That was real. That, that that looked really. Like, that, that looked like PS1 or PS2 quality of that helmet. I'm not sure if that was supposed to look like that. I didn't expect, like, I didn't expect to have an RPD. When was, when was, like, an RPD, like, when was one of these kinds of weapons, like, maybe? I, I'm, I'm pretty sure that these things were in 1982 or whatever, but... You wouldn't really expect to see, like, these kinds of outfits in a 1982 kind of setting. Well, I wouldn't know. Is it, it's 1982, isn't it? Uh, that this game is for I can't remember. This is really easy. <laughs> you know, I, I don't want to reload. You guys shoot the rest. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you, you're just not going to shoot him, just going to run, try and run right past him, and then you realize. Oh, wait, it's our guy. Okay, escape, yes. Everyone in. Hey, yes. Get in, get in. Don't die. Oh. <laughs> the action in this game is... They, they made the action in this game how it should be in every call of the game. Now, the action in this, like, storyline... Like... I played, uh... 2019 Modern Warfare, and, um... There was a lot of action, but this has way more action. Uh, so, thank you all for watching this video. If you like to hit the like button, subscribe. Uh, join the Discord, join the Reddit if you guys want to. Um, let me pause the game. Uh, so, uh, thank you all for watching this video. If you like to hit the like button, subscribe. Join the Discord, join the Reddit if you guys want to. Um, follow my socials if you guys want to. Like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you all in the next video. Wolf. Out.